Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great. So in this video, we will talk about the interview process at Flipkart for software engineer one role. So recently I uploaded a reel on Instagram giving an overview of the Flipkart interview process for SD1 role and you guys requested me for a detailed video on YouTube. So here it is. So in this video, we will talk about the whole interview process in detail and stick to the very end of this video to understand what kind of salary you will get if you join Flipkart as a software engineer one. So without any further ado, let's get started. But before going into the interview process, let's understand who all can apply for this software engineer one position. So this position is meant for people who are fresh college graduates or have like one or two years of work experience. So the whole interview process of Flipkart is actually divided into three rounds. The first round is problem solving round. The second one is machine coding and the third one is HR round. Now, one thing to mention here, after all these three rounds, if the hiring manager or the HR is not able to decide whether to hire you or not, they may take one or two extra rounds. Now coming to the problem solving round, this is similar to any other problem solving round that you see in other companies. So basically you will be asked one or two coding questions that you have to solve using data structures and algorithms. Now the first question is kind of easy to medium level and the second question is a bit harder. So if you have Flipkart interview coming up, then do prepare well on the data structures and algorithm part. Now coming to the important topics that you should focus on for this problem solving round. According to me, I feel like you should be focusing on graph, dynamic programming, strings and hashing. Now let's go to the second round of the interview process. That is the machine coding round. So those who don't know what machine coding round is all about. So this is a round where they evaluate you based on your knowledge over low level design concepts like OOPS principles or solid uh, principles. So coming to the machine coding round of Flipkart, this round typically exists for one, one and a half hour of duration. Now within this duration, at the beginning of the interview, one interviewer will come and tell you the question, right? And this question is not similar to problem solving round while a question. So this is not related to any data structures or algorithm, right? So one example of this kind of question would be library management system or designer RAM. That sort of a question you will get. Now, once you and your interviewer are on the same page, understanding the problem statement and you are clear on what all things you need to implement or you need to code, the interviewer will go away and you have one hour of time to code this solution. Now, after one hour, the interviewer will come back and you and your interviewer will discuss on the solution you have written. Now, one thing to mention here, you can use any programming language of your choice to code this solution. Now, for this round, the expectation from you would be your code should pass all the test cases given by the interviewer. Secondly, your code should be modular enough, like you should be dividing your code into different functions and your code should be clean. So these are the things that you should consider and also the interviewer will check that what kind of low level design principles you have used in your code, right? Let's say you have used solid principle in some place, right? Then they will ask why you have used that thing, the kind of decision making you have done, why you have done that. So that is something that you probably have to explain to the interviewer. So one major factor of evaluation for this round is how much extensible your code base is. So basically it may happen that the interviewer at the end of the interview, they can tell you that, Hey, I just want you to add this feature or maybe I told you that this feature would be in this way, but right now I want that this feature should be built in a different way. Now they, what they want to see here is how you are making those changes. If just to make that small change, you need to make a lot of changes in your code base. That basically means that it's very hard to incorporate new changes in your code base. So that's a red signal. So if you guys are confused over what kind of resources you should be using to prepare for this machine coding round, then do let me know in the comment section and I will try to make a video on this. So the third round of this interview process is basically an HR manager round. So in this round, you will be asked questions related to your past projects or be some behavioral questions or some situation based questions like you have been put into this kind of situation. What will be your reaction or how will you tackle this situation? One example of this kind of question would be, let's say, tell me a time when uh, you had an argument with your manager and how did you tackle that thing? So that kind of a question you can get in this round. So if you're applying for an SD1 position, then 
probably you won't be having a system design round but if you are applying for sd2 or higher position then you will be having a system design round apart from all these three rounds now as promised let's talk about the salaries now if you join flipkart as a software engineer one then you will get a base salary in the range of 17 to 19 lakhs per annum and a total compensation of 21 to 26 lakhs per annum now this total compensation consists of three parts number one is your base salary number two is performance bonus which is nothing but 10 to 15 percent of your base salary and the third component is ESOP. Now, apart from these three components, many people actually get a joining bonus also. So that's all for today. If you like the video, then do let me know in the comment section. And I will be back very soon with another interesting video. Till then, bye-bye.